After watching this, you will stop getting excited about the $25,000 Tesla Model 2. Does the process of mining raw minerals for Tesla batteries produce any greenhouse gases? Does this have any negative impact on the environment? Let's find out as we discuss the environmental impact of Tesla batteries in cars, child labor in African mines. Automakers and environmentalists hail electric vehicles as one of the answers to pressing environmental issues like climate change catastrophe and air pollution. EVs have electric drivetrains, which result in zero carbon emissions. However, the lithium and cobalt used to make EV car batteries are environmentally destructive and infringe upon human rights. Electric vehicle lithium-ion batteries have a significant adverse environmental impact. Massive volumes of water are becoming increasingly scarce in many parts of the world and are needed for lithium mining. For every ton of lithium extracted, 500,000 gallons of water are needed. Miners bore a hole in salt flats and pump salty, mineral-rich brine to the surface to collect lithium. After a few months, the water evaporates, leaving behind lithium and other minerals. That is interesting. Not only is water wasted in mining lithium ion, but it also poses a significant danger to miners. We'll see why shortly. Lithium mining pollutes water, land, and air, and utilizes much water. In mining, toxic chemicals like hydrochloric acid can flow from evaporation ponds and damage the surrounding landscape. The large volume of lithium ion waste is an additional issue with lithium ion EV car batteries. For instance, just 2% of the country's 3,300 metric tons of lithium ion batteries are recycled in Australia. Typically, lithium ion waste is disposed of in landfills, where it may leak and pollute the environment. The biggest mining firms in the world coexist alongside miners who manually extract copper and cobalt from the ground while wearing little to no safety gear. A rising amount of Kolwezi's cobalt is produced by an estimated 150,000 handcrafted, or illegal miners who dig by hand. In contrast, most of Congo's cobalt is produced at huge mining sites where rock is excavated by trucks from the bottom of deep holes. That is so dangerous. A growing number of kids are drawn to unregulated activity as they try to keep up with the sharp rise in demand for batteries and electric vehicles. Congo's supremacy poses a significant problem for automakers and those in the supply chain. The potential of corruption, as well as monitoring and enforcing regulations to prevent deaths from illegal mining and the presence of miners on these sites, are just a few of the additional dangers they will face if they try to improve the situation on the ground. According to the United Nations, access to safe, sufficient, and affordable water, sanitation, and hygiene facilities is one of the fundamental human rights. In light of this, human rights are violated while mining lithium for EV car batteries, and this is because it contaminates water and wastes a lot of water in dry locations. According to the UN, a clean, healthy, and sustainable environment is also a human right. Lithium and cobalt mining compromises this human right by contaminating the water, air, and soil. Furthermore, a lot of lithium and cobalt mining occurs in underdeveloped regions. Inhumane and dangerous working conditions are typical for miners. For example, miners are exposed to significant risks, including cave-ins, falling rocks, poisonous gases, extreme heat, and loud noise, diseases like silicosis and TB. The majority of them earn wages that are substantially below the poverty line. To enrich yourself with videos like this, do not forget to subscribe to this channel. Bolivia, one of the undeveloped nations in South America, is where a large portion of the lithium is mined. Elon Musk and Tesla were accused of attempting to topple the Bolivian government to acquire access to more of the country's abundant lithium supply, which worsened matters. Musk famously stated in a tweet that they will coup whoever they choose. Although miners earn minimal wages, Elon Musk and his team have introduced the Tesla Model 2, which is less expensive. We'll look at the price shortly. Elon Musk and his group made several allusions to the Tesla Model 2's upcoming lineup during the Battery Day briefing. Several sketches and concept designs floated around, 
even though the conference call did not provide images of the design. The China-made model is sure to be as stunning as the entire Chinese Tesla project. Also, the fact that the Model 2 will be built in China will give it a state-of-the-art look. According to Musk, some of the best works of art in the world were created in The compact hatchback, compact, and crossover body types are some of those that are anticipated. These form factors appear to accommodate all driving requirements. The way we drive today has drastically changed thanks to electric vehicles, yet one of those vehicles' constant flaws has been their high price. Previously, affordable electric vehicles were not feasible due to the high cost of materials. Still, as Elon Musk introduces the Tesla Model 2 concept to the public, this is beginning to change. Tesla's autonomous driving capability was rumored to be included in the Model 2 but their new 4680 batteries were given priority. These batteries are so named because they are 46 mm by 80 mm in size, in addition to producing 5 times as much energy, 16% greater range, and 6 times as much power as conventional batteries. They are also significantly less expensive to manufacture. The new 4680 batteries are anticipated to provide the Model 2 with a travel range of 250 to 300 miles. The best part is that everything is now produced on site and is no longer an ocean. The Model 2 is anticipated to have Tesla's customary screen and upscale interior, despite costing under $25,000. We believe this is why Elon Musk said, when something is important enough, you do it even if the odds are not in your favor. The Tesla team implied the strong likelihood of autonomous driving being incorporated when they admitted during the conference that they debated whether to include a steering wheel or not. Given the Tesla Model 2 review, it offers a lot of comfort for the money. The Tesla Model 2, produced in Shanghai, China, will be the first Tesla made outside of the United States in 2023. The Model 2 features a cutting-edge appearance because of its detailed craftsmanship. Now that we've seen how negatively Tesla batteries in cars impact the environment, can we say the Tesla 4680 battery serves the purpose alone must promised? We recommend our next video. The truth about the Tesla 4680 battery. Is it really solving all EV battery problems? To satisfy your questions. Thanks for watching.